Good morning, my friends. It is Monday, April 27th. We are in the last week of April. Can you believe it? Wow, this month has flown by. Let me just say that I miss you. I miss seeing your bright, smiling faces every single day. So let's get to it, shall we? Today is Monday, April 27th. 2020. The weather today is going to be 64 degrees, partly sunny, partly cloudy. You might need a little jacket, but I think you could still go outside. I don't think we're going to have any rain today. Our memory verse. We're going to keep practicing. It's all you this time. Are you ready? Here we go. Let's do it one time all together, shall we? John 3, 23, 5, 1, another. Good job, friends. All right, now it is time to do our calendar. Here we go. We're going to count all the way to 27. Turn on your brains. Here we go. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, whew, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five. 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, we're almost there, 26, 27. Good job, friends. Round of applause. Pat on the back. Kiss on the cheek. Okay, friends, let me just say that we are starting a new family project today. We're just so thankful that God created our bodies, and the way we take care of our bodies is eating healthy and exercising. So this week, I want you to work with your families, your grown-ups, and help them make a tasty treat every day for your family to share. And it could be simple, like celery with peanut butter or carrots and ranch, or maybe you can make a sandwich. That would be easy and make sure it's healthy. So all this week, work on helping your families make something nutritious and healthy for you to share. Then on Thursday, that's the last day of our week this week, because we have a short week. On Thursday, I want you to make your own recipe. And I'm talking whatever you want. You want it to be something spicy. You want it to be something sweet. It has to be all you. I want it to come from your brain, your thoughts, your creativity, and just have your grown up write it down exactly the way you say it and then email it to me. Then over the weekend, I'm gonna make a class cookbook. Yes, because I wanna see all of your recipes. Absolutely. So make sure you start thinking about that. Talk about recipes, what a recipe is, that it's kind of like directions on how to make something, whether it's a cake or cupcakes or a sandwich. The recipes are important. It helps us learn how to follow directions. At the end of the week on Thursday, you're gonna be making your own recipe and emailing it to Mrs. Wilson. We're making a class cookbook, okay? Have fun, have a blessed day. I'll see you back here for Bible and our story time.